Hey staff, so I just want to share with you a math resource that might get kids engaging in Seesaw and building basic math skills. So it is a website called Coloring Squared. And when you go there, it is like basically mystery pictures. Um, and kiddos can color in based off of their math facts. Um, they have place value activities and rounding, regrouping numbers, geometry, all kinds of different things, fractions. Anyways, I'm going to go and show you how to put one on Seesaw and what kiddos could do with it. I'm going to choose to come over to characters, uh, superheroes, and I in the past always chose mostly multiplication and division, but I also like it because you can differentiate with where your students are at. Um, and so you're going to see just kind of what it looks like. Okay. I actually chose the Spider-Man. Uh, so what you would have to do is you would have to click on it. You would have to download it maybe um, so that you'd be able to upload it as a template. Um, I saved it as a file. Maybe you could like drag and click it onto your screen. But regardless, um, this is what it would look like. And then you would download. Okay, so coloring squared. Now let's go to Seesaw. Oh, ha, 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 ha. I'd already set one up. That's so funny. Okay, and yeah, let's. Thanks for being so patient. It's like working with kiddos. Okay, so I want to add one. So I'm going to go to assign activity. I'm going to create a new one. I would type in here maybe like Spider Man Multiplication. Of course, I would type in some directions. Um, and copy and read it so that they can hear my voice. But then I would go down to the template for the students to color in. And I would upload. I'd select it from my computer. And um, I'm going to look for the Spider Man, Spider Man. Here we go. And now I have it for them to color using their choices down below, all the different color on their palette. So let me save it. And let me assign it. Okay, so it's assigned. Now let me pretend I'm a student. So if I'm a student, I see, oh yeah, Mr. Massimino, he's so awesome. He knows I love Spider-Man. I'm going to do that activity for sure. <laughs> so I pick my name. Now, you're thinking that it's kind of small and difficult for them to see. So if you find that, you can always show your kiddos to come over here to the plus and they can enhance it. Now, if I'm wanting to do my math problems, right? Um, first, let me see. Red in the key down here, red says, any answer from one to 20. So maybe I pick this, I'm gonna pick red, and I'm gonna start coloring in my math facts. Uh, yeah, nice, that's gonna be, you know, red, except I don't really want it that color. But you get the gist, right? Is this is something you could do with your kiddos? Let me see. Maybe I'll pick a this Sharpie. Red. All right. So this is red. And this is red. And this one's red. Anything from 1 to 20. And I would start coloring it in. So um, it's just an idea to try out. Maybe see if um, kids are engaged and a way for them to practice some of the basic skills that you're doing in class. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, always feel free to reach out. Hmm.